Using a Sony Reader PRS600 to make notes on academic articles by Doug Belshaw. Recently my parents were kind enough to buy me an Sony Reader PRS600 for my EdD studies. I'm having to read lots of academic articles at the moment so I need to create notes and I need to highlight text. Here you can see me using the highlighting text feature of the Sony e-reader and I'm highlighting some text and I'm going to add a note. Once I've highlighted the text I turn off the highlighting tool and I tap on the text and I've got a choice of making a note by drawing or by keyboard. For this one I'm just going to make a handwritten note which I find faster. It's going to be a bit scruffy because it's facing you instead of me. I'll just put this as a note, press done, and then I can do the same again but for the keyboard version. So I highlight the text that I want, and once I've highlighted that text, I do the same thing again, turn off the highlighting tool, and when I've turned off the highlighting tool, tap on the text, and I can choose the keyboard option this time, and it just puts a virtual keyboard on display, and you can type in whatever you want. I find this a bit slow, so that's why I like the handwriting version. Once you've done this, it saves the notes alongside the file, so when you plug your Sony Reader into your laptop or your computer, it syncs the notes back into the iTunes-like Sony Reader application, and that means you can use them for your studies, which is really handy. So here's a Sony Reader application, I want to show you that next. So here we are in the Sony Reader application, it's a bit like iTunes in the way that it's set out, and you can see that the Reader is connected on the left hand side there. If I click on the little icon to the left hand side of it, you can see that it's got a, a mirrored structure, uh, the same as is on my laptop, and it's been completely synced. It doesn't take two seconds because it's all text. If I open up the article, which we've just seen on the Sony Reader device, and I click on the highlighted text, you can see that the note that I made on the Sony Reader shows up. And again, this is the one that I made using the keyboard. So I'm finding the Sony Reader a really useful tool. It means I don't have to print out lots of articles, it means that I've got everything with me and I can make notes quickly and easily on the go. Fantastic.